Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back for another weekly grind video. I know I did not do the global one last week, but I did do it yesterday, and that's why I'm releasing this today. If you didn't see yesterday's video, I am doing this week's JP weekly grind um, on Thursday instead of Wednesday, just so I can make up for the time. Uh, I didn't want the video to be 20, 25 minutes long. So uh, here we go. We're jumping into this. Do me a favor, make sure to hit that subscribe button if you guys are new here and you like my content. Remind you at the end of the video, just... <laughs> Anyway, first things first, the Gohan Easy A is here uh, for the Intelligence uh, OG Dokkan leader. Uh, it ends at 731, so you have about another week and a half left before it goes away. Um, go ahead and do this uh, in order for you to get him Extreme Z Awakened. He becomes a pretty damn good unit when he gets Extreme Z Awakened too. Um, again, it runs until 731, and you get some Grand Elder Kai's as well as you get up through the levels. I still haven't done it yet. I'm not going to be doing it on the JP side, but I will be doing it on the global side. Uh, next one is going to be the reprint of the Dragon Ball GT event. That's going to be available where you get your Goten or evil Goten. You get Vegeta. Goten does Doken Waken. He is a good support. I believe he does uh, defense buffs for physical units. But I know he definitely does key plus three for physical mono physical units. So definitely worth getting him Doken Awaken at least a super attack 10. You do not need to get two panels unlocked of him unless he like gets a future Doken awakening we'll have to wait and see maybe he will one day but as of right now he's just a support unit for key if you're liking key links the other one's gonna be vegeta highly recommend getting him he has a second Doken awakening so go ahead and get him Doken. will get him super tech 10 uh Doken waken him get him i would say at least top left bottom right do path he's not you don't really need the do pans but you never know if he gets another Doken awakening where those buffs go from flat out buffs to percentage buffs Anyway, um, in terms of this, you have Goten available from Stage 2. Goten Medals are on Stage 3. Uh, oh, no, sorry. Gohan Medals are on Stage 3. Goten Medals are Stage 4. Uh, Baby Vegeta Medals are Stage 5. Trunks Medals are Stage 6. Vegeta Card actually drops on Stage 7. Um, stage 10 is where you get the most Hercule badges um, in order for them to drop in order for you to go into the Baba Shop and use them. It also drops the SR... Hercule statues if you're running low on Zenny. Highly recommend grinding that out if you're low on Zenny. Um, and to get some of the Baba Shop stuff. Go ahead, look at the Baba Shop, see what you want, what you need, and uh, base it off of that if you have time to grind. Again, summertime for me, so I do not spend my time grinding mobile games. I spend my time making YouTube videos. <laughs> um, anyway, this ends on 724, so you have six more days left of that. The other GT event is here as well. Um, this is the Goku GT event. You have the Chi Chi's available on stage one. There's no enemies on that stage. Uh, so you get the Chi-Chi items. I think it's stay left and stay right, but let me know down in the comments below. Correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, stage 2 is going to be Gohan, Goten, and Trunks medals, which is all available from this event as well. So you don't need to go and grind them out there. Uh, Gohan is available on Stage 3. Trunks is available on Stage 4, which I think, yeah. So um, that's for the first time these two are available on these two. Um, and then you have Hercule badges available on Stage 5, which I still recommend going on to this stage over here, Stage 10 on the other event, if you're trying to actually grind them out. And Super Baby Medals are available on Stage 6 to get him Doken Awaken. Uh, Gohan and Trunks are available here. They do Doken Awaken. Um, they do do support. So Gohan is a key support unit, which actually means that this guy up over here, this Trunks is only, or sorry, this Goten is only going to be key support. Uh, Gohan is key support plus defense buff, and Trunks is key support and defense buff, which actually does come in pretty handy, especially as a free-to-play card. It's only 30% buff, but it's still decent. Um, and this is the Super Baby Vegeta, the one who gets his second Doken Awakening. Um, you don't need to, but he could become very, very good and viable for a free-to-play uh, agility unit for prime battles if you're looking to run a, an agility team. I did that team building guide about a year ago if you want to go check that out. Uh, Dokkan Battlefield is available until 731, so you can go ahead and grind that if you want to. You now, now you can now get the LR Korra if you want to go ahead and do that. I don't think he's worth it in my opinion, but he is there. And you get a whole bunch of other units that are available. As you see the Majin Vegeta, you have the Goku. Um, LR Ginyu and all that other stuff. There's a whole bunch of cool stuff you can go up in here and grab and, and fight with. So it's going to be a lot of fun if you want to go ahead and do that. Um, again, available till 731. Good luck if you're going and doing that. Uh, next is going to be Fierce Battle. Um, pretty much this is the Goku event that's available uh, uh, for the new full power, uh, ultra power Super Saiyan 4 Goku. Awesome unit. Highly recommend getting him if you haven't got him. I did two summons on that. Uh, so I will be releasing that at some point. But yes, two summons. I uh, did not grab him. So spoilers, you know. <laughs> Uh, anyway, that is available if you want to go ahead and give, get, try your luck and go that that runs until 731 You still have another week and a half left of that um, The new GT event is available for super 17 um, You go up against Android 17 here. You can increase his super attack to the other Android 17s You have Android 18 here as well um, You could also grab a cell or, or not. Yeah, a cell and a Frieza or a Frieza 
from this event each path gives you goes down the one path where the other one is available so uh, you can go ahead and grab the new two new free to play ones that means you could increase some of the cells and freezes uh super attack and you also need the medals from this event on stage seven for goku if you happen to pull the uh the kid goku from the banner um but yeah that's available yeah freeze it here <clears throat> but the freezes for gt only cells for gt only so they only feed into the gt cell and uh frieza uh android 18 and, and android set well android 18 is only for um uh for gt i think uh 17 is hellfighter 17 i'm pretty sure it's hellfighter 7 so that should be available for him again available go ahead and grind them out if you want to at least get the free to play ones of super attack 10 um you don't need to do and wait you don't need to do all four do pass but because they do drop as ssrs you might as well do it you know what i mean uh next is going to be the other dragon ball gt it's all a bunch of gt crap uh, 719 runs until 719, so closest tomorrow. Uh, get the Gohan and Dokken Wakens into the Super Saiyan Gohan, G Goku GT. Uh, Metal Rildo is there, who will Dokken Wakens into the Hyper Metal Rildo. The Goku is pretty cool. He also feeds into the other Goku Super Saiyan Goku GT if you want to feed that into him. Uh, you also have the Trunks. Definitely get the Trunks medals. You want to Dokken Wakens in this Trunks. He's a pretty good support unit, so go get the Trunks medals to keep us to attack and defense plus 25% for allies. Uh, in terms of this event, Goku is available from stage two. Pan medals, or sorry, Trunks medals are still at stage three. Pan medals are stage six um stage eight is going to be the the rildo medals or with the medals you need for rildo rildo is stage nine and dr miyu i think his name is available on stage 10 and if you're looking to get the actual apples uh stage seven m2 if you're looking for better apple drop rate per stamina go for uh, the hard because you get more uh, apples per stamina if you're looking just to use up your stamina go ahead and do it on z hard because that's where you're gonna get your uh, not your most bang for your buck but you're gonna use up your stamina a lot quicker at least that's what i found out a long time ago from what i read at the post um in terms of that i think that's it now we're going into the summons summons available until 731 this is the ultimate gohan where you have Korra and you have uh, physical goku black that sucks if i summon on that i feel like i'm gonna get a whole bunch of goku blacks i prefer i want to try and go for the Korra. that's when it comes to global so make sure to summon on that if you if you lack any of them um they're all pretty good units personally Korra 120 lead obviously i uh, really like that so i'm gonna be going with him myself if i if that one that comes available um, you also have the Majin Buu Saga category summons that are available, runs until 731. If you if you want some Majin Buu Saga categories, go ahead and do that. That's what you need in order to take on the Easy A Gohan. You need that category, so that's going to be very useful. Um, it looks like we also have the Elder Kai banner that's available until 731. I did not summon on this. I didn't. I, I should have summoned on it, but I did not summon on it. The reason I didn't summon on it is because all the good units that I have, um, I already have my Super Attack 10, and I don't really go too hard on JP anyway, so I don't I need that. But that runs until 731. Make sure you do that before it leaves because you won't get it back until the next time an Eldar Kai banner comes out. They are very, very good. Um, and then, obviously, you have the festival for the Ultra Super Saiyan 4 Goku. You can go ahead and summon on that when you when you want to. It looks like we have the availability of Vegito and Gogeta and the Super Saiyan 4 Goku. Highly recommend going and summoning on that banner. Very, very good. I'm Honestly, on the global side, I'm probably going to start saving my stones for this specific banner because I could use dupes of pretty much and new cards of all of these guys. So that's going to be awesome. Runs until 731. Definitely go and do that. And then there's also the secondary banner with Super Saiyan 4 Goku, where you get the new GT units. I mean, if you want to summon from them. I, I mean, personally, this banner looks a hell of a lot better. I don't know why you would summon on, on this banner over this banner, but this banner is here if you want the new GT. Anyway, guys, thank you for joining me here today. That's it. Make sure to hit that sub button. If you guys are new here, show support for the channel. And uh, I'll catch you all in the comments below. You all have a good one. I'm probably down in Virginia by this point. All right, I'll catch you later. Peace out.